You look like you could use a drink, my friend. Yeah, I could. I'm a developer for this big financial institution, and we've all been called back into the office because we need to connect to this crypto exchange. We're going to be hunkered down for months, and that is the end of my beach holiday. I know that crypto exchange. I work in finance too. We actually did something very similar just last week using VMware cross cloud services. It was pretty easy. I'll tell you what happened. So our CEO gets crazy excited about crypto and calls in our CIO. We need that crypto exchange. Gather your apps clan and get them on it. Snap. And our CIO is like, I'm on it, but my lead dev is at the beach. I'll call him. So the CIO calls me right and says, dude, let me give you the lowdown. Assemble your team and get us hooked up to this new crypto exchange. First, build an app to connect to the crypto. That's in AWS. And lock that thing down tight, dude. Then you need to update our core apps so that we can talk to it and do fraud checks and all that sort of stuff. And we've got to get this to our customers super fast. So push an update to the digital portfolio app that we've got running on Azure. I'm like, yeah. So I call my teams together and we swarm on the apps and I'm starting on the AWS crypto. So I open my laptop and I'm zip zap coding and I'm just keeping wait, going. Wait, wait, wait. You're doing this from the beach? You work in finance. You can't do that kind of work here. Actually, I can. Check this out. We've got this Anywhere workspace set up from VMware. My laptops are in Workspace ONE, and I connect with this thing they call VMware Secure Access Services Edge. It makes connections back to the mothership fast, secure, and reliable. And we also have this thing called Carbon Black, right? Which is like this digital Uber cop. Look, I can name drop security all day, but yeah, I can work from the beach. So you've built apps like this before, and you have access to everything? Yeah, and more. My team uses Tanzu Application Service to build 12-factor apps in a snap and launch to prod in minutes. But this crypto thing, it's multi-cloud and multi-Kubernetes. So we start with Tanzu App Platform. It's got everything and works great with any Kubernetes. My enterprise architects give me these quick start packs called App Accelerators. Each accelerator has the stack you need, like Spring, Python, Ruby and Node. All the libraries and dependencies you need to get started and not just to deploy. App Live View gives me this gorgeous app visibility too. And for the images, we can just go to the VMware Marketplace, get verified images, databases, and service brokers, whatever you need. So just write our code, push to prod, and that's it. So what do you mean you push and that's it? You surely have to get security and ops involved before it hits production, right? No, the Tanzu application platform does it all. Source ingest, testing, build packs, and deployments. It does it all in the background, just like that. I wish that would work on my pipelines, though. It does. I mean, we use loads of different tools. Nature of the beast, right? Mm -hmm. But you can still have the same experience. Take Tanzu build service. You can use Tanzu build service on any cloud with any tools. AppOps have eyes on all our CI CD pipelines and everything's cool. They've got them all security, workflows, all automated. AppOps see the code, inspect and check, and then deploy faster than you can say DevSecOps. Hang on. So it's all deployed and secure, and Ops is cool with this even though they have no idea what's inside their code? Oh, they know all and see all. They know exactly which resources are ours and have resource quotas on my team and the app and permissions to make sure we don't take too much. They have all the workflows automated, make sure the code is legit against known vulnerabilities, and can even check that whole environments are policy compliant. They can see exactly which services are spinning up, what they're doing, and how much it's costing. Oh, and they're like, I'm checking you aren't making objects with too many permissions, like a bucket left with open access, you know? That's amazing, but what about your core apps? Oh yeah, the trusty but crusty apps. There is a bunch of legit API tech to soup those up. So I need the crypto app to run across Azure, AWS, and my existing apps. Tanzu Service Mesh connects it all with globally addressable namespaces. And Tanzu Labs team has ready-made application architecture cookbooks. I applied one to my core apps so I could expose its APIs while keeping it protected. Okay, but what about your customer app? Right, right. So we have the app, it's in Azure, right? So we push an update and, oh, it's going a bit wrong. And it's this section here. You can see it's slowing the whole thing down, taking 25% of the transaction time. So 
We tweak the code, push, deploy, monitor, and the code is all good. It's faster and cheaper, and our customers are like, this crypto is sublime. Look at my diamond hands. So that's it, you're done. Yeah, we're on version nine now. We've added some cool new stuff. The CEO is well happy. Hey buddy, uh, need anything? Yeah, VMware cross cloud services. 